These Chinese characters translated to English mean one step and relate to an ancient oriental saying, a journey of a thousand miles begins with one step. When it's the name given to a Chinese junk, it holds promise of romance for the eight crew members setting out on a five-year voyage of adventure among the islands of the Pacific. While in port, the one step becomes a floating art gallery and visitors crowd aboard to see and buy. The paintings on display are the work of Sydney artists Jeff Pike and Bob Booth, and profits from sales will go towards financing the expedition. The man from Snowy River, the hero of Banjo Patterson's poem, the central personality of an Australian legend. The striking faces to be found in lands south of the equator inspired these portraits. Some of the paintings depict more salty themes. Add to the atmosphere and surroundings of this unusual gallery the very evident talent of the artists concerned and some pictures are bound to change hands, including a portrait of a New Guinea native and son. For the eight adventurers, every painting sold means another one step along the leisurely five-year course toward Fiji, Tahiti, and other romantic ports of call. In her native environment, a Chinese junk wouldn't rate a second glance, but outward bound from Sydney Harbour, she's a picture for an artistic eye.